Hi little stars and little starlets, Monica here and hey hello to our little stage called Teddy Bear. Today my friend Kelly is going to do a wonderful lesson with you. You may know her as Pirate Georgie from Legoland. I hope you have a really happy Saturday and a big hug from me. Bye! Good morning, stars and starlets. My name is Kelly and I'm here today to teach you an exciting lesson through the camera. This is great, 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 great fun and we're all going to have a wonderful time. Now then, the first thing we need to do is I've told you all my name, but I don't know any of your names. So, after three, I want you all to shout out your names as loud as you can for me. Ready? One, two, three. Now, I think you could be a little bit louder because I think we need to wake every grown-up up in your house. So, should we try one more time in our biggest voices? I'll tell you what, why don't we try by standing with our feet just slightly apart, our shoulders back, that's it, hands by your side, let's support. And if you've got a nice straight back and a nice long neck, we create a huge space that we can support in our tummies so that our voices are supported and go all the way forward nice and loud. So let's really, really project. Let's push that magic P. We're gonna push those voices right out. So here we go, after three, ready? One, two, three. That was so much better now. Can you now come right up to the camera? That's it, right up to the screen. I'm gonna come right up to you. Hello. Now, I want you to use your quietest voice not a whisper but a very very small voice shall we try that and i'm going to use my microphone let's turn it on there we go ready so after three can you use your tiny voice ready come up to the screen one two three well done everybody that was amazing you used your big voice and your little voices amazing so up we pop, that's it. We are going to start with a warm-up. And the warm-up is start sitting on the floor, but the best way and the only way to get on the floor is to blow up our balloons and sit down in the best way, the BTS way. So I want everybody to have a think about their favourite colour. Now, my favourite colour is... It's going to be red today, so I want you to think of your favourite colour and then I want you to take your imaginary balloon and we're going to blow up that balloon and we're going to take some steps backwards. Should we take three steps backwards? Let's have a little practice. So standing up, everybody, think about your favourite colour. After three, I want you to shout out your favourite colour. Ready? One, two, three. <gasps> Amazing. So that's the colour of your balloon. Now mine's going to be red. So, I'm taking my balloon, I'm going to blow up my balloon, I'm going to take three steps backwards. Here we go, ready? My balloon is really, really blown up, but what might happen is my balloon might go pop, and when it goes pop, we're going to sit on the floor. Ready? One, two, three, pop! Sit on the floor, and the best way is the BTS way, which means our legs are crossed. That's it, I'm going to show you how to cross your legs, just in case. Here we go, so one leg, amazing and the other leg and it tucks in just under there that's it and then we put both knees on the floor hands on our knees we have our shoulders down our shoulders are back our backs are lovely and straight and um, as i said before this lovely long neck so we've got a huge great supported space all ready for action and our first warm-up well done everybody give yourselves a big clap lovely so we're all sat down ready to warm up but Oops, I don't know about you, but my feet aren't awake, so I think we need to wake them up. Are your feet awake yet? It's good if they are, but if they're a bit like mine and they're a bit sleepy, they need a bit of help to wake up before we can do our warm up. So I want everybody to take one foot and keeping a straight back, and this is a lovely stretch for our legs as well. We're going to put our foot, you can see that I've got bare feet today, so you can see everything that's going on. You see my toes, give a little wiggle for you. So I'm going to hold my foot and I'm going to tap my toe and I'm going to say, wakey, 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 wakey. 
Oh, dear, should we try the other foot? Here we go, ready? So taking it up, lovely stretch, straight back, lovely, tap, 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 wakey, wakey, in your biggest voice, wakey, wakey. Oh, dear, that didn't work. Now I wonder what else we could do to wake up our feet. I need all of your help. So let's put on our concentration caps and we might even need to put on our clever cloak. So let's put on those clever cloaks. Don't forget to do yours up. Now my clever cloak is going to be, it's going to be red today. I'm feeling red. Yes, I love that colour today. So my balloon was red and my cloak was red, but yours can be any colour you like. What colour would you like your clever cloak to be? Ready? After three, I want you to shout it out for me. One, two, three. Fabulous. So now we've got our concentration caps on and our clever cloaks. Let's work out a way to wake up the rest of us. So feet are still asleep. So what else could we do? Hmm. I know. We could stand up and stomp our feet. Is that a good idea? Brilliant. So everybody stand up. Here we go. And we're going to stomp, stomp, stomp. And stomp, stomp, stomp. And say, wakey, wakey feet. Wakey, wakey feet. And I'm also using my arms, which is warming them up as well. And my legs. But, oh dear, are your feet awake yet? Because mine aren't. So, let's think of something else. Um... <gasps> I've got it. Why don't we run around the room? Ready? That should work. After three, ready? One, two, three. There we go, running around. Wakey, wakey feet. Wakey, wakey feet. Wakey, wakey feet. Wakey, wakey feet. Oh, I don't believe it. They're still not awake. Let's try one more thing. I think we should try jumping. Ready? So we're going to bend those knees, nice soft knees. We're going to pull right up and point our toes, leaping into the air. And when we land, we should wake up those feet. Should we give it a go? Ready? After three. One, two, three. Wakey, wakey feet. And again, wakey, wakey feet. Oh, they are definitely awake now, but in case yours aren't, and if you had a different idea and a different way to wake them up, now's your chance to ready. After three, I want you and your grown-up to wake your feet up in the way that you think best. Ready? So here we go. One, two, three. Wakey, wakey feet. Wakey, wakey feet. Amazing. Well done, everybody. So that's your feet taken care of and our legs, but... We've got these to take care of. Our hands. So I want you all to give a hand a big clap. A round of applause. Amazing. Well done. And then I want you to shake them. So let's shake our hands. Oh, it's going into my, into my arms, into my shoulders, into my middle and into my hips. Oh, and now my legs. Oh, and now I'm completely shaking. Shake, 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 shake. And stop. And shake, 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 and stop. And shake, 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 and stop. And one more time. Shake, 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 and stop. Now then, I want you to shake those legs. Here we go. Ready? And shake, 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 and stop. And shake, 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 and stop. And again, shake, 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 and stop. Amazing. Well, that's our feet, our legs, up from the bottom to the top all woken up we've woken up our voices so i think that we are super ready to do our warm-up number one so let's sit down the best way the bts way ready so here we go we're going to do a beautiful sit down we're going to jump up crossing our legs hands on your knees sitting up nice and straight with a big smile here we go first warm-up which is busy feet which i'm sure that lots of you know but in case you don't let's have a quick chat through first of all so this is going to wake up everything even more so we're going to have a bit of a waving with our hands and we have a bit of a this oh fabulous another bit of a waving and we're going to use those thumbs amazing and we are going to put our legs out in front of us so we to put your hands by your side that's it put one leg unfold the other leg put them together sitting up nice and straight and we're going to pull those toes right up so i'm going to sit all the way back so you can see my toes amazing and that's how we're going to start excellent 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 and the rest you can follow me it's very, very easy to follow. And if you know the words, sing out because I'm going to sing as well. So let's start with our busy feet warm up. Here we go. Good morning, good morning, good morning, Disney team. Good morning, good morning. 
morning, good morning everyone. Good morning, good morning, it's time to have some fun. Good morning, good morning, come together everyone. Hello busy feet, it's great to see you all. Let's sing this song one more time. Are you ready? So let's go on to our second warm up everybody and this is my favourite because it's all about animals. That's right, we're going to do the animal warm up. We're going to warm everything up just as they would in the zoo or the jungle. Now, I wonder if you've got a favourite jungle or, or zoo animal or even a pet at home. It can be anything you like. What do you think it might be? Hmm, after three, ready? Here's my microphone, turn it on, whoops. One, two, three. <gasps> Amazing, well, that animal may well feature in the warm-up, but should we see whether there are other animals as well? So, we're gonna dance around, and as soon as you hear what the animals are, we're gonna dance around as those animals. So let's have a little bit of fun, ready? Here we go for our animal warm-up. So, let's stand up, everybody. Here we go. Lovely. Come on, come on, clap your hands. Come on, come on, it's warm my time. Come on, come on, clap your hands. Come on, come on, it's warm my time. Stop. Tiger. Come on, come on, it's warm up time. Come on, come on. 
Last time, everybody. Come on, come on, clap your hands. Come on, come on, it's warm up time. Come on, come on, clap your hands. Come on, come on, it's warm up time. Ready? Yeah. Oh, well done, everybody. Excellent job. Put your hands up if you love music. Put your hands up if you still want to continue with animals, because we love animals, yes we do. So, following along from the same theme as our warm-up, we're going to stick with animals. Now, do you have a favourite, favourite animal that you would like your first freeze position to be in? I want you to have a think about it. Put those concentration caps on again. Put those clever cloaks on again. My cloak's going to be silver this time. What colour's your cloak? Amazing. Now then, we are going to dance around to the music and when the music stops, I want you all to freeze in your favourite animal position. Then when the music starts again, we're going to freestyle, but when I say copy Kelly, I want you to try and copy the moves that I do as well. Then we'll all be doing the same moves together, which will be fantastic. And then I'll give you the instruction on the second freeze position, what it should be. Okay, so I'm going to put the music on. We're going to have a dance around, completely freestyle, show us your best moves. If you've got grown-ups in the room, grown-ups, join in. Let's wake up this whole house. Yay! BTS. Yes, yes, yes. So, we're going to dance around the room. First position is your favourite animal. Will it be a monkey? Will it be a zebra? Will it be a giraffe? Or will it be something else? Might it be a unicorn that happens to be your favourite animal? A dinosaur? It can be anything. An animal from the jungle? An animal from the zoo? A pet at home? Something from a farm? It can be whatever you want. So, let me see you standing up. And let me see you move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. You like to move it. All girls all over the world. Original King Julian upon your case, man. I love how all them girls move them body. And when you move your body, I'm moving yeah. nice and sweet and sexy. Alright? Yeah. Right? Okay. Woman, you're cute. And you don't know makeup. Original cute body, make up my mother. Woman, you're cute. And you don't know makeup. Original cute body, make up my mother. So, your first animal, mine's going to be. Can you guess what I am? I'm a lion. What are you? Oh, amazing. Now then, we're going to freestyle again, but then I'm going to say copy Kelly so you'll follow me. And then our second position is going to be a unicorn. So, let's start music dancing around the room. Here we go! and Kelly and this time when the music stops we are going to sit on the floor. You can sit on the floor as you, not just as an animal or you can sit on the floor like an animal. Up to you. So carry on copying Kelly and when the music stops we're going to sit on the floor but careful of your bottoms, don't go down too hard. You should be on nice comfy uh, carpet anyway at home. Luxury of doing this from home. Here we go, ready? And carry on. I like the moment, moment. I like the moment, moment. I like the moment, moment. You like that? sitting down the best way the BTS way amazing are your legs crossed are your shoulders down are your hands on your knees <gasps> amazing this time when the music stops I want everybody to lay down that's right you're gonna lay down so let's have a practice so the music will stop and this time again careful with your bottoms and your heads don't go down too crazy here we go so oh the music will stop lovely oh and if I'm laying down oh dear I might snore 
still see me, ah, but you'll definitely hear me. So when the music stops, we are going to fall asleep. And this time it's freestyle. Don't copy me this time. I'm going to put the music on. Just Take don't the moment, me. Moment. Yeah, like that. Move it. Oh, laying down. And let me hear you snoring. One more time. Ah, I'm going to come up to the screen. You stay down, laying down. I'm bringing my microphone up so I can hear you. That's it. <laughs> Marvellous. I'm going to put the music on and when the music stops, I want you to lay down again. Okay? Ready? Up you get everybody. Oh. Down again. Ready? Snoring. And down you go. Was I being mean? I hope you're all laying down. Are you all laying down and not moving? Because that's the thing to remember as well. You can snore, but try not to move. Amazing. Should we do it one more time? Ready? Let's have a good dance around. Let's shake, shake, shake. Here we go, everybody. And this time, I want you to stand on one leg. Now, this is kind of tricky, so you can put your arms out. Press down strong as if they're resting on a table either side. Take your leg up. <gasps> there we go. Animal poem. Fantastic. So now that we're sitting at the BTS, the best way, let's just calm things down a bit because we've been a little bit crazy. We've run around the room, we've warmed up, we've had some dancing games. So now let's calm down by sitting beautifully and we're going to take a couple of lovely deep breaths. Now we're going to breathe in using our noses. So breathe in and you're going to breathe out like you blow up a balloon. Amazing. And breathe in through your nose. If you keep your mouth shut, ready? Lovely, and breathe out, blow your balloon. Very nice. And we're just going to warm down a little bit. So we're going to roll those shoulders. <gasps> Lovely, shake those hands, unfold those legs and give them a bit of a shake after all that dancing around. Fantastic. So let's stand up everybody. And I thought what would be really, really nice to do now is for us all to learn a poem that I've written especially for you, stars and starlets. Sticking with our animal theme, I'd love to teach it to you. I will start with the first line and then when I do this, you repeat and then we'll carry on until we've done the whole first little section. How about that? Does that sound good? I can't hear you. <gasps> Amazing. So let's stand up. Amazing. We're going to stand beautifully. So feet slightly apart. Make sure those hands are by your side and your shoulders are down. That's it. Lovely straight backs and lift that chin a little so that when we speak, everyone can hear us. In fact, not just your grown-ups in your house, but how about it's so loud we wake up every house in your street. That sound good? Amazing. I don't know that they'll thank you for it though, but we'll have fun, won't we? Yes, yes, yes. So, standing beautifully. I'm going to start the first line, and then when I do that, you repeat. And it's called, We Love Animals. And it's got some little actions as well, so let's give it a go, shall we? So we start with, we love animals, your turn. We love animals. Amazing. This time, I'm going to do it once through, and then I'll do the actions, but I won't say anything so that you can copy the actions knowing they're right, but you can say the lines. Here we go, ready? We love animals. Brilliant, let's carry on. Yes, we do. Your turn. Brilliant, let's try both of those together. We love animals. Yes, we do. Your turn. Amazing. Let's try one more time. Ready? Why don't we try all together after three? One, two, three. We love animals. Yes, we do. Brilliant. Should we carry on? Amazing. In the jungle and in the zoo. In the jungle and in the zoo. 
Your turn, ready? So I'll do it, you repeat. In the jungle and in the zoo. Your turn. Should we add it all together? So we've got, we love animals. Your turn. Yes, we do. Your turn. In the jungle. In the zoo. Amazing. Should we try the whole thing together? Ready? So, we love animals. Yes, we do. In the jungle. In the zoo. Your turn. Amazing. Shall we carry on? We repeat. We love animals. Yes, we do. We love animals. Me and you. So that was the whole second bit. We repeated for a bit, didn't we? We repeated, we love animals. Yes, we do. We love animals, me and you. So let's try that whole second section together. Here we go. So I'll do it all the way through. Then you will. I'll say, Zoop, but I'll do the action. So here we go. We love animals. Yes, we do. We love animals, me and you. Your turn. Incredible. Let's try the whole thing together. The first section and the second section. So I'll do it and then you can repeat. Okay? So here we go. Ready? Concentration caps on and clever cloaks on. I don't know why I wiggle, but I think the wiggle gives me even more cleverness. <laughs> if that's even a word. Here we go then. So feet slightly apart, shoulders back. Lovely. And this is We Love Animals. We love animals, yes we do, in the jungle and in the zoo. We love animals, yes we do, we love animals, me and you. Your turn. Now I'd love you to have a little practice of that with your grown up and once you know all the words and the actions you can try to practice on that voice. Bring Here we go everybody, stars, starlets, now let's do a little bit of a dance. Okay, so this is the bare necessities. This is really, 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 really fun. Who knows the story of the jungle bird? Put your hand up if you do. Amazing. If you don't, then why don't you ask? Once we've finished, you're grown up to tell you the story. It's a fantastic story, all about Mowgli and his friends, and some that aren't his friends. See what happens to Mowgli. The beginning, the middle, and the end of the Jungle Book. Would you do that for me? Amazing. Now, let's start with this fabulous routine. I want everybody to start with a step clap. So we do those four times. So we do step and a clap. And we're going to do the other side, step and clap, step and clap, and step and clap. And I'd really like you to have a look at your hands when you do that. So we do step and clap, look at your hands. There we go, fantastic stuff. Ready? Next little bit is we've got really, really strong arms. And we're going to take them out. And again, and out. Fantastic. So let's go back. So we do a step and a clap, and a step and a clap, and a step and a clap, and a step and a clap. Strong arms. Brilliant. And then to finish it off, strong arms go on your hips, head up. So we've got strong arms on your hips. So we've got step and a clap and a step and a clap and a step and a clap and a step and a clap. Strong arms. And there. One more time. And look at your hands and look at your hands. That is fabulous. Well done. Strong arms. And strong. Oh, should we try that with the music? Amazing. Here we go, everybody. So. The bare necessities. 
Look for the bare necessities, the simple bare necessities. Forget about your worries and your strife. I need the bare necessities, oh Mother Nature recipes to bring the bare necessities of life wherever I want. And everybody, that was amazing, and it was brilliantly remembered by everyone joining in. Grown-ups, I think you need to join in as well. And if you know the words, join in. So, I'm going to teach you the next little bit. We're going to go for a little bit of a walk. So we're going to do a bit of marching, yes? And then we're going to bend our knees. But you know what? We're going to do it with the music because you can follow me. Should we do it that way? Amazing. So after our clapping, we do that twice through. We're going to go on a little bit of a walk and we're going to bend our knees and then we're going to have a little point. So you have a look. So let's go back to the beginning and we'll carry on and you can follow me. Ready? Here we go. Look for the bare necessities, the simple bare necessities. Forget about your worries and your strife. I need the bare necessities, oh Mother Nature's recipes, to bring the bare necessities of life. Wherever I wander, wherever I go, I couldn't be farther of my dear home. The bees are buzzing in the trees and make some honey just for me. When you look under the rocks and plants and take a glance at the fancy ants and maybe try a few. Did you manage to keep up? Well done. Let's have a little recap over that little bit we just did. So, when you go for a walk, very good. Then we're going to bend our knees. Bend our knees two times, that's first time, and the second time. Then we're going to point up high to bring some honey back for me. When you look, you're going to look really low. Amazing. And to finish off this last little bit, I want you to put your hands back here. And we've got three head movements to the side. One, two, three. Amazing. So we go from here. Look. Hands here and a one, two, three. Lovely. I think we can finish the whole phrase off. The bare necessities of life will come to you. They'll come to you. So let's try that again. So you've got the bare necessities of life will come to you. They'll come to you. Amazing. Let's do the whole thing without music and then I'll put the music on. So we've got step and a clap and a step and a clap and a step and a clap and a step and a clap. Strong arms. Strong arms and repeat. Step and clap, look at your hands, very nice. Excellent, strong arms, strong arms. Then we go for a walk, very nice. Then we're going to bend our knees. One and two, point and sharp. There, and look really low, very nice. Put your hands in here and your head, one. Two, three. The bare necessities of life will come to you. They'll come to you. <gasps> Amazing. You are fantabulous. You're the best. You're BTS. So let's try that all the way from the beginning. But this time, when the music starts, I want you to wiggle. So before we step and clap, we're going to wiggle. Do you think you can do that for me? Amazing. You are incredible. Let's go all the way through. Let's have some fun. Grown ups, you join in too. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Now, the last thing that we're going to do today is we're going to have a bit of a calming, warm down game and exit. Now, we're going to stick with our animal theme and our masks from earlier. And I think I'm going to be a zebra. I'm going to put the zebra mask on and I want everybody to move as far away from their screen as possible. 
Okay, so I'm going to move back, you move back, and we're going to play a fabulous game called Animal Footsteps. You've probably played it before. If you don't, I'll explain. So, you move all the way back, that's it, as far as you can, that's it, and I'm going to move back as well. Now, when I'm facing the back, you can all come towards me, but when I turn around, you have to freeze. Now, just like the Jungle Book, we're going to use lots of different animals. So the first time you come towards me, I want you to try to be an elephant so you can stomp towards me and then when I turn around you have to freeze as your elephant and grown-ups I want you to have a look and if they're wibble wobbling I want you to send them back to the wibble wobble wall so here we go everybody go all the way back I'm going to move back as well so that gives us a longer gap and more of a chance for you to come and tap the screen ready so when I turn around you move when I turn and face you you don't here we go see you at the end Oh, that was a sneaky, I didn't turn all the way around, but you still can't wibble wobble. That's it. Have you got your elephant stomping? Are you up in midair? Or did you put your foot down? Have you got your trunk? Amazing, good stuff. Ready, elephant still. Are you nearly there? Are you nearly coming up to me? Now, why don't you try being a slithery snake? So go down onto the floor. Go down onto the floor. And I want you to be a slithery snake slithering along. Ready? Here we go. So down on the floor, grown-ups as well. Ready? Down on the floor, where in your positions that you were. And go, 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 go. Oh! I have a feeling that most of you are going to be at the screen and the camera by now. Brilliant. So go all the way back, all the way back. This time we're going to be a tiger. So I want you to come forward to the screen and try and tap the screen and tap me, but as a tiger. Okay, ready? Off we go then. So you go back and I'll go back. Here we go. And go. Stop. Freeze at your tiger positions. And again. Right. Now I would like you to be a bird. Use those wings beautifully. You can soar or you can flap your wings. But when I turn around, you have to freeze. Or go back to the wibble wobble wall. Here we go. One more time. Here we go. And finishing off, well done everybody, well done, well done. You have been fantastic. I hope you've had a lot of fun, as much fun as I have, with our animal-themed class today. Thank you, stars. Thank you, starlets, for joining us. Thank you, grown-ups, as well. So, I hope to see you very, very soon. In the meantime, practice the little poem that we've learned, the bit of dance that we've learned. You could have a little practice of all the balancing and the warm-ups, the busy feet, the animal warm-up, the dancing game, so you can play when you play the music and then you can freeze as a different animal. Anything that you want to do to practice would be amazing, all animal themed. And when I next see you, we'll continue with lots and lots of fun. Goodbye, stars and starlets. And say, BTS is the best. Yay! Bye-bye. Well done. Have a fabulous rest of your weekend. Bye-bye. This is Kelly saying over and out. Bye!